welcome back to the channel. Um, yeah, as you just seen, we just wrapped up an 8K run. And now we're gonna hit some abs. So today in this video, we're just gonna do a bit of um, day in the life type of stuff. I'm gonna go train legs. I just signed up at World's Gym in Ashmore, which is like five minutes up the road. And I've been training with my mate Cody. So we're gonna hit legs today. Um, that's why I only kind of did an 8K run. The running's not too crazy at the moment. It's just kind of maintaining fitness. And yeah, it's pretty much it. But what I'm gonna, I'm just gonna hit a little ab workout now. And then um, I'll shower up, have some brekkie and Murphy's come to join me. You want to come on? <laughs> yeah, we're going to hit this little ab workout and then I'll show you what I have for brekkie and I'll probably just show you what I have um, throughout the day as well. Pretty much a full day of eating, training, and yeah, that's it. strap that I got off the owner that focuses in. See if we can see that. There we go. And we're gonna give this a go. It's supposed to be better than ropes because yeah you can kind of put your hands through and then like wrap it around like that and then takes away the tension from using like your forearms so let's give it a shot. that you can put more weight on it because you don't have to like hold on to those handles from of like the rope so yeah it actually works pretty good we're pretty much done with abs now so we're gonna have a shower and cook up some breakfast We're just about to go train legs, so I'm done, gonna chuck a kit on. Got these new Metcon 8s, because I literally have no shoes to squat in. So yeah, first time I'm gonna try these out. Keen, let's chuck them on. All right, today's gym fit. We have Alice KD oversized tee on. I'll show you the back. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's working or not. And then we got the five inch shorts. These just came out. Um, yeah, these have pockets here, and they also got a zip pocket here. Five inch, much better for leg day. <sighs> Can actually squat good in these. Look, those legs are getting a bit bigger there. Come on, man. <laughs> and we got the new Metcons on, and we're going the long socks today, so that's a gym fit. All right, guys, I'm actually in a bit of a rush, so I've got to be quick with this. Um, we've got our pre-workout here. Hercules subs, that's what I always take. 
best subs in the game. These ones, I'll leave my code on the screen for these as well. So yeah, just training legs today. So I'm just gonna take the pre-workout. I do have the pump product as well, but yeah, I'm not really too fussed if I don't get a massive pump on legs. So I won't be having that today, but that has been amazing for upper body sessions. So I usually have a scoop of that and I'll either have, I'll have the pump either with the pre-workout or this fat burner that I've just got as well. So I've kind of just been alternating between the pre-workout and the fat burner because that's also great for gym sessions as well. So today we're just going with the standard pre and then we've got one scoop of the recovery of the God's intra workout in this one liter bottle. I drink a lot of water and fluids throughout the day so I will smash this whole thing um, during my session. And then, yeah, like I said, I'm in a bit of a rush, so I'm just gonna have this banana. It's around 9.30 at the moment, and this LCM. This isn't like a full-size one, and it's like a lower sugar one, so it's a bit healthier. But yeah, um, that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys at the gym.
Pretty just wrapped up that session. Oh, that was tough. <laughs> My legs are absolutely cooked, but I'm getting so much stronger. Um, if you guys watched my other um, day in the life video, I think it was like two or three weeks ago, I was doing sets of 100 kilos, and I think I was doing, I think I was doing like five to six reps, but they were pretty sloppy. And then I think I did a set of 120, and I'm pretty sure I might've got like one or two reps out. So today, I think what we do, we went 120, I think I got five to six pretty decent reps out. So you probably noticed I got like those knee sleeves and the belt now as well. So I've seen a heap of other guys using those, and I'm like, oh, I'll order a few. So I got a few off Amazon and actually works so good. So um, yeah, it was actually a great session. I'm just loving training legs at the moment because I haven't done them like pretty much all year or they've just been like half hour session because you guys know I do heaps of running. Um, yeah, I'm sorry if you guys follow me just purely for running content because that's not just what I do. I love training in the gym as well. And um, yeah, I used to like do fitness modeling like bodybuilding competition so it's actually good to start training real hard again and hope you guys kind of enjoy the gym content as well so it's pretty fun um yeah that was a brutal session cody is an absolute beast i've been training with him a fair bit he's he's so strong in legs i can kind of get up with like close to him with a few weights on like other exercises but man on the legs he's an absolute beast so um i'll leave his instagram on the screen at the very start or whatever and um yeah you can check out his instagram he does some sick reels and stuff like that and he's just a legend of a guy so plenty more videos to come with him um but yeah i think it's like 11 11 30 now so i'm gonna go home have a meal and then i've got to go see my accountant and sort out all my tax so not fun at all after that i might have to go do an electrical job 
not too sure yet, but yeah, you guys know I'm kind of making that transition into like more just like content creation, doing YouTube and stuff like that, which I love. Um, so yeah, if you guys can like, subscribe, it's gonna help me out a shitload. Um, but yeah, we're gonna head home, have something to eat, and um, yeah, refuel. Go see the tax man. <laughs> All right, guys, we're home now. Got a meal here. That's about, I think it's like 200 grams of cooked chicken. I cook all my meals or like I cook two meals for every day of the week on Sunday. So if you follow me on Instagram, you probably know that already. But this has got 100 grams of mixed veg in it, 100 grams of white rice. I've reduced my carbs a little bit because I am trying to lean up and I'm not doing as much running either. So yeah, 100 grams of rice, 100 grams of veg and 200 grams of the cooked chicken. This is a sauce that I put on it, barbecue sauce. Just be really careful with what sauce you put on, like your meals, if you're dieting or if you just want less calories. Like this is, um, I've found this one to be probably the best fountain. Even some of the other no, like reduced sugar ones aren't as good as this fountain one. So just check the label and see how many like calories per serve or per 100 grams probably. Um, We've got 150 grams of pineapple, and that's just fresh pineapple that I cut up last night and put in the fridge. Then we've got a glass of magnesium. This is a magnesium powder that I have. Great for muscle recovery. Um, yeah, with all the running that I do, I always try to have this stuff pretty regularly. And obviously I trained legs just before, so that's gonna be good for recovery as well. So that's my lunch served. It's about 12 o'clock at the moment, and we're gonna smash this down. Right, just about to go see the accountant, see um, how much tax I've got to pay. I'm hoping that it's not much, but yeah, I'll let you guys know how it goes, but nothing real interesting <laughs> to let you know. But yeah, I think I might head um, to recovery lab later on for a sauna and the boots as well. So yeah, stay tuned for that. All right, guys, just got home from doing my tax. Um, man, I hate that shit. <laughs> but luckily I don't have to pay as much tax as I thought. Um, just made a meal. I've just heated it up anyway. We've got um, extra lean beef mince with some white rice and I'm gonna put some tomato sauce on that as well. So it is um, currently nearly four o'clock now so I haven't actually eaten for like three hours which isn't like me, <laughs> so I'm starving. So I'm gonna smash this down, do some work in the office and then um, yeah, I might try book in a sauna at Recovery Lab, maybe, we'll see. I'm just about to head to recovery lab. I've managed to book in a sauna session, but I've quickly made a smoothie. It is 10 to 6. So in that, I've got 100% whey. I've just got one scoop, so around 40 grams of that. I've got 300 mils of just unsweetened almond milk and 100 grams of banana. So I usually just cut up a heap of bananas and freeze them. So yeah, that's going to go down. That will keep me full until I get back, and then I'll make some dinner. That is the sauna and their boots done. The sauna, it only gets like 70 degrees and I swear like I've been going to the gym ones, I reckon they get way hotter than that. So I was in there, I had about five or 10 minutes to, to go and I was obviously starting to sweat up, but I was kind of like, just wasn't hitting the same because like all the gym ones, I can usually like 20, 20 minutes is like my good spot. Like around 20 minutes I'm dying to get out of there. And then I just did 30 minutes in that and I was like, oh, it's not that crazy. <laughs> but anyway, we're gonna go home and we're gonna cook some dinner up because I'm starving. And um, yeah, I'm keen to just to chill out. Like when I had the boots on, I was nearly falling asleep. <laughs> so 
All right, as much as I don't want to cook right now, it's like eight o'clock, I have to cook food. So we're gonna cook up some chicken and some potatoes, but I think we're gonna do like chips in the air fryer because I haven't shown, shown you guys how I do those. So that's the plan, chicken. I think I'll probably cook a heap in the oven just so it's done for the rest of the week and I don't have to cook it again. And yeah, we're gonna do some chips in the air fryer. So I'll show you how I do it. All right, here we've got it. On the menu tonight, we're gonna to do this chicken breast. We got 1300 grams there. So we're gonna cut all that up and season it with just a fajita mix. That's how we're gonna make our chips with these. Um, the macros are like so good on this. I'm gonna have 600 grams. So if we go here per serving, which is 250 grams, we've got 500 kilojoules, which is like I think like 125 calories. So if I'm having 500, if I'm having 600 grams, that's going to be just over around 300 calories for all those chips. But it makes a heap. So yeah, I'm going to cut up this chicken now, get out my chips ready, and yeah, do all that. These I just snack on. These these are so good. Probably shouldn't have too many. Too many if you're watching, if you're on a diet or something. But they're amazing. This contraption is literally the best thing ever. Put potatoes in there and it goes like that. And it turns them into chips, so. All right, I've cut all that chicken up into kind of strips and I'm going to chuck that on there and I'm just going to mix that all around and then chuck that onto some baking trays. All right, chicken is all laid out. Going to put it in the oven there. We've got the oven at 200 degrees fan forced. So yeah, these should take about 10 to 15 minutes pretty quick. This is the perfect, well this is the secret to making perfect chips in the air fryer, this basket. So what I'm gonna do is spray that with a little bit of spray oil. Then I'm gonna put all the potato in there and that is gonna go into the air fryer and it pretty much like rotates really slowly and it cooks the, put the chips just perfectly. So let's do it. Chicken is done, that's looking perfect. Always seems to taste so much better out of the oven, I reckon, rather than like pan fried. Like it's just so much more tender and like keeps all the flavor in, but yeah, it's looking real nice. So I'm actually starving because my chips aren't ready. So 200 grams of chicken, I've separated that from the rest. That will be for the rest of the week. And I think I'm just gonna have this now because yeah, I'm starving and now I'll have the chips. All right, this is the result with the chips. Nice and crispy. And then the key is to put plenty, plenty of this on. Shake of fries, chicken salt. Who said you can't have carbs when you're trying to diet? Look at that. That's only around 300 to 400 calories or something, but yeah, so filling and literally tastes amazing. All right guys, that is it for this video. I got my little ice cream here. I'm gonna have this and then head off to bed shortly. It's getting pretty late, I'm pretty tired. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're not subscribed already, make sure you subscribe. I'll be dropping a week, um, one video a week, hopefully. Um, I want you guys to let me let me know what you also want to see. If you do want me to do that tattoo tour as well, I'm thinking about it and it's got a few requests. So yeah, let me know, drop a comment. Um, and yeah, like always, I'll see you guys on the next video. See ya.